Okay, class. May ayah niya agak hangkat ng tanah. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Okay. So, ang topic po natin ngayon ay yung variation. Okay? So, in 3, 2, 1, and action. So our topic for today is variation. So meron tayo tinatawag na number one, direct variation. Okay? So direct variation. Ayan po. Direct variation. So paano po bang direct variation? So sabi, say for example, y varies directly as x. Say, y varies directly as x. X, okay? So, halimbawa, sabi dyan, Y varies directly. So, direct proportional or direct variation. Directly as X. So, kan ganyan po ang word, ibig sabihin po niyan, Y is equals to K times X. Yan po yung magiging formula natin. Or magiging key equation. Okay? So, meron tayong K dyan. Yung K dyan, ang tawag dyan sa K ay? Tawag dyan sa K ay? Constant of proportionality. Okay? So, constant of proportionality. Yan po yung K na. Constant of proportionality. Yan. So, yan po yan. So, yung number 2. Ano po sa number 2? Inverse variation. So, may ilong inverse variation. Okay? So, ano po yung mga sentence dyan? Y varies inversely. Yan, mga ganyan. Inversely. Inversely. As X. Inversely as x. So, ganyan po. So, paano po yan? So, magiging y is equals to k over x. Nandito naman yung x sa ilalim ng k. Ganyan. Or y is inversely proportional to x. Ganyan yan. Meron namang tinatawag na joint variation. Ano po yung joint variation? Joint variation is ganito po yan yung joint variation. So ganito po yan yung joint variation. Z yan na varies jointly. Yan mga ganyan. Jointly as x and Y, ganyan. So, ibig sabihin niya, yung formula mo ay C is equals to KXY. Magpumultiply lang po siya. Naintindihan, class. Nasusundan. Class, nasusundan. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, simulan natin. If Y varies as X, and is equal to 11 when x is equal to 7, find the value of y when x is equal to 5. So, ano to? The word nitong y varies as x. Ano yung sasunan? Direct variation. So, yung key... Okay? So, direct variation. So, key equation natin. Saan tayo magsisimula? Sito. Key equation. Ayan, kakanta-kanta na lang. Pakanta-kanta. So, key equation is 
y is equal to kx. Equal to kx. K -X. K -X. Yeah. And then. Yung y daw ay equal to 11 when x is equal to 7. So, yung sabi dyan, 11 yung y, okay, when x is equal to 7. So, therefore, k equals to 11 over 7. 7. Good. 11 over 7. Okay. Next. Balik na tayo sa formula. Find the value of y daw. y is equals to when x is equals to 5. So, magiging 11 over 7. Tapos yung x mo daw ay equal to 5. So, times 5. So, y is equals to 55 over 7. 55 over 7, wala na. So, yan na po yung final answer na natin. Okay? So, nagkakaintindihan. Tignan nyo lang kung ano yung word kung directly or inversely or joint variation. Naintindihan? Naintindihan? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, next example. Of Z. When X is equal, ano yan si Mipa Ingan yan? Equal, at least the value of X when X is equal to 6 over 7 and Y is 5 over 28. Ayan, question mark. Naintindihan? Naintindihan? Ako ha? Yes, sir. O, paano yan? Solve na natin. Key equation. Key equation natin. Equation natin. C is equals to, ayun na. Balis directly. K X Y K X Y K X Tapos, inverse yung SY over. Plus, ang sagot, over. Y. Ayan po. Y. So, meron siyang value na. Ano yung value daw? So, ano value daw? 4. Is equals to K. Tapos, ano yung, ano yung X? 12. 12. So, over. Ano yung Y? 8. Eight. Eight, sir. Simplify natin, ha? Magiging Four. Uh -huh. Four is equals to K Ano yung 12? Divided by 8 Magiging 4, 4 So magiging 3 dito 2 dito sa kapapapa Multiply So K is equals to Multiply, magiging 8 Over, divide by 3 Ayan na po, yung K natin then, Z is equal to 8 over 3 times. Ano yung X? Ano yung X? 6 over 7. 6 over 7. Divided by 5 over 28. 28. Oh, ayan na. So, magiging, oh, multiply. 8 times 8. 8 times 6. 8 times 6. 48. 48. 48. Over 3 times 21. 21. 21. 5 over 28. Ang mangyayari dyan, ito sa baba, imumultiply natin sa taas. So 48 over 21 times. Ang mangyayari, babalik ka rin natin ito. Yung 28 magiging sa taas at yung 5 magiging sa baba. Ayan siya. Mamultiply. 28 times 48. 28 times 48 1,344 1,344 Simplify na lang natin Ito, 7 divided by 7 So magiging 3 
divided by 7 magiging 4. So, 48 divided by 3 times. Hindi sa kabila is magiging 4 over 5. Ito, pwede pa ba yan? 48 divided by 3, pwede pa ba? Pwede ka. 4 times 48. 192, sir. 192, sir. 192. 192. Over... 3 times 5? 15. 15. 15. 15. So, the value of C is 192 over 15. So, yun po yung final answer natin. Nagkaintindihan po ba? Over 15. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, directly at merong inversely na nakaano sila? Naka-join po din yan. Inversely, Ayan, inversely, tapos directly, tapos naka-join ko pa rin. Kaka-intindihan po tayo, Clark? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So, thank you for listening and God bless us all. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you, sir. Sir Lloyd Lester. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye-bye, sir. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, sir. Bye-bye, sir.